So guys, this is Ardik here and today I'll be showing you the most cheapest and the most powerful power bank. So let's get right into it. So this here is the actual package that it comes in. It's the box and as it says it's from Intex and it's as you can see 11,000 milliamp power. So it's pretty pretty tough. So uh, on the box it says you can charge your mobile phone, the mp3 player and even the mp4 player. Then here as you can see it says it's new. So you just have to check it, uh, check this. If it says new then it's new, if it doesn't say it's new. Uh, probably you got the older one and also there will be a seal right over here so just check for that then behind it says uh, there are some specifications that are given over here uh, which are input 5 volts 2.1 amp maximum uh, you can see there are three USB ports in this uh, power bank so the first one is 5 input 5 volts 2.1 amps max second is uh, uh, input second is the same and the third one is uh, 5 volts at 1 amp so it's a slow charger but for fast charging you actually need input 5, 5 volts and 3 amps so that's a fast charger but anyways this will get your work done then plug and play dimensions contents that you'll get in the box is mobile battery charger also with a micro usb cable and a user manual so that's pretty much it uh, nothing much uh, again, it's all it again says it's an 11,000 milliamp power, power bank, so that's cool. And this is the box here again. So let's quickly take the power bank out and let's see what it has to offer. So just break the seal and take the power bank out. There we go. We'll keep it aside for a second and we'll see the user manual guide for quickly. And there you can see here is the user manual guide, and then it says how to charge the power bank uh, it's pretty pretty normal nothing here but anyways just have to mess with it and yeah. then we have the actual power bank that comes in this packet so we have a USB cable over here which is not that long but it will get your work done anyways then we have the power bank itself so we'll keep it aside for now and there you can see it's 11,000 milliamp power power bank from Intex we have three USB ports over here on the back it says the first one it's uh, 5 volts 2.1 amps the second one is the same and the third one is 5 volts uh, at 1 amps and here down below it says ITPB11K that's the model number for this power bank and yep there we go made in China and yeah that's basically it uh, also you get a flash that over here so we'll just turn on the power bank real quick and there you can see it's not completely charged at the moment but it's halfway charged then you get a neat feature over here so if you just double tap the power button let's see what happens so double tap the power button there we go and as you can see the flashlight turned on double tap it again went off we have an input over here so to charge the power bank just have to plug in from over here and it charges so uh, this power bank will take for forever to charge it but let me know in the comment section below if you want to test uh, if you want me to test the charging uh, time for this power bank so double type it again and as you can see the flashlight turns on and it's pretty bright to be honest not gonna lie uh, it will probably help you more the night times so basically as this is 11,000 milliamp power bank let, let me guess the capacity over here so for example my Nexus 6P it's 3400 milliamp power 3450 so let's say this 11,000 milliamp power will probably charge my Nexus 6P for around three and a half times or three hours to be perfect but yeah three hours uh, three times and then 50% around 50% yep so it's actually pretty huge uh, so yep that's been it uh, it's actually it, it won't charge my 6p uh, it won't fast charge my 6p so it's actually 5 volts 2.1 amps and the adapter uh, with the 6p is as you can see it's 5 volts at 3 amps here you go as you can see output 
so it's actually not fast charging the 6p but it gets the work done i'll be posting a screenshot uh, down below as you can see it's it's not that much of a difference but probably 10 minutes more or 10 to 15 minutes more and that's it it's actually pretty good in that case so yeah that's pretty much it thank you for watching this video it is the cheapest power bank i've, I've known and i'll be giving the link to purchase this power bank in the description below so yeah that's been it it's actually pretty cheap 15 to 16 dollars that's it so yeah that's about it thank you for watching this video if you like this video give it a big thumbs up and do subscribe to my channel if you're not already subscribed and i'll see you guys in the next one